just cut them in half. Yeah. So today I went and picked up some pumpkins to give to the chickens while I was in town. And uh, Toby's going to whack them in half. Because they're pretty good size. Just half, just, just half. The other one may be fourth, but that one just half. Oops, half. Alright, we'll just pop that side off. That, we can, I can give that to the roosters. Wah! Now, I'm going to also save the seeds on the, some of these so that we have uh, pumpkin seeds for next year. Four. Yeah, if you can get it in four, go ahead. That's okay. Oh, that's what it is. The machete's not big enough. All right, now you can take one and cut, like, take that one there, kind of get put the seeds over there so they ain't going flying. Just cut that in thirds, because I got a perfect spot for that one. Yeah. <laughs> you can't get them all. It's all right. We'll just be growing pumpkins out here by the chickens next year. It doesn't want to go. <laughs> it, 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 however, I'm just going to give it three pins. All right, now I'm going to give it to some chickens. I think they like it. The meat chickens are really enjoying their pumpkin. Um, be nicer if they didn't have their feet in it, but you know. They get into their food. They're huge. Good morning. It is Thursday. And uh, I've already done my chores. Um, I believe everything's ready to go to... Uh, for me to start back work so I thought I would share the update on the um, Cornish cross chicks uh, they're huge um, drying out some pumpkin seeds um, I believe they're inside these monsters Um, I fed them, so it's you don't think they grow fast, boy. I'll tell you, they're monsters. Hey, fellas, they have worms. Ow! Ow! That hurts. Now get your finger. Where are you going? We do have some little ones, but for the most part, they're pretty good size. Uh, right now, they are getting fed. There's 40 birds in here, by the way. They are getting fed. They're 17 pounds of feet a day. And in two weeks, um, it will be processing time. And they are uh, just as healthy as they can be. I have not lost any birds. I have all 40. And uh, 
I can't wait to get everything all done. Um, raising this mini is not something I normally do. Um, there's a lot of work to this. Make sure you don't lose any. I was able to find them a used little giant waterer. Um, it is saved me a lot. Um, it's a 10 gallon and I only have to water them, um, fill it up every other day. Um, get back in here. Uh, but it, it really has saved me a lot of time and I don't have to worry about them running out of water. Um, they didn't quite finish their pumpkin, but that's about all they're going to eat of it. So, Like I said, I don't normally raise this many. This was uh, a venture with my son uh, that turned into a nightmare. Um, and I won't get into that. If you choose to raise these birds, you have to be really careful to not overfeed them. Uh, especially in the beginning. Um, as if they grow too fast, they tend to just lay around all the time. So, that's why I raised them the way that I raised them. I do have the information on my website. So, if, um, or if you want to know how I did it, feel free to contact me, send me an email. And I'll explain everything I did. Thank you.